Here is a step-by-step guide to understand how to register and participate in Life Eco Hackathon. First, go to the website codemetra.org eco life and click here to select your language. And then click on the participate button. If you already have an account, you can log in with your PIN. If you have forgotten your PIN, you can log in with an OTP. If you are new to Codemetra, then click on sign up and create your account. If you are a student, then click on I am a student. If you are a teacher, then click on I am a teacher. If you are a student, then you can fill out this form and set a PIN to register. If you are a teacher, you need to fill out this form and set a PIN to register. Teachers can follow these steps. If you are a teacher, log in with the number which you have used at the time of the registration process and you can either log in with an OTP or the PIN that you set earlier. After successfully logging in, you need to either click on the participate or the resume button. Please note, if you are logging in for the first time, you will see a participate button option and at your next attempts of logging in, you will see the resume button. Now, as a teacher, you can click on the copy link button to share the link of this competition or you can share a QR code with your students to participate in this competition. Students can follow these steps. After successfully completing the registration process, please log in with the mobile number used at the time of registration and enter the PIN which you set earlier to log in or you can also log in using the OTP which you will receive on your phone. After logging in, you need to click on participate slash continue. Here, you will see three steps that you need to follow. Watch videos and complete the activities. Step 2. Submit your ideas. Step 3. Get the acknowledgement certificate. For step 1, click on the start task to watch videos and complete the activities. When you click on step 1, you will see this window where you need to complete 13 tasks. Please note, class-wise the number of activities can differ. Please watch this first video and then click on the right arrow button for the next activity. You can select a suitable language here. To listen, click here. In between the videos, students need to complete a simple activity or a task. You can select the language to listen to. To start the task, click on Get Started. When you complete step 1, you can see a green tick mark at the corner. Then, please proceed to complete step 2 by clicking on Start Task. In step 2, you need to complete 3 tasks. Task 1. Watch the video to understand how to submit ideas. Task 2. Submit your ideas in the form of a video or audio or any type of doc, PPT, PDF format or you can type in your idea. To record a video to submit your idea, please click on the record video. When you record video with the Chrome browser, it will request permission to use your camera and microphone. After selecting the always permit access to your microphone and camera, select done. Click try again after this. Students can now record videos. Click stop recording when the recording is complete. Click on play preview to know what you have recorded. Click retake video if you would like to retake your video. Please click choose a different method if you would like to submit an idea via a different way. Please click confirm video if you are satisfied with your video. Please note that you cannot change the video after you click press the confirm video option. You will receive a notification that your concept has been successfully submitted after the video has been verified. Please click record audio to submit your idea in audio format. When you record the audio with the Chrome browser, it will request permission to use your camera and microphone. After selecting Always Permit Access to your microphone and camera, select Done. Click Try again after completing this. Now you can start recording. When you finish your recording, click on Stop Recording. Click Record again if you wish to record your audio again. Click on Play Audio to hear your audio clip. Please click choose a different method if you would like to submit your idea via a different way. Please click submit and continue if you are satisfied with your audio. Please note that you cannot change the audio after you click on the submit option. 
For uploading your file, please click Upload File to submit your idea in an MP3, MP4, JPEG, PDF format. By clicking on Choose File option, you can upload the relevant file after choosing the file format. You can then click on the Submit option. For typing your idea, you can click Enter Text and you can submit your ideas in any language. Students can submit their ideas here and write about them in depth in any language. After completing this, students can click on Submit. Now let's move on to Task 3. Here, you need to answer these two questions. Select the theme related to your idea and what type of support you need to implement this idea. You can then click on Submit. Please give your experience a rating. Click Submit to submit your response after answering the following questions. Would you recommend this hackathon to others? Would you like to participate in it again? Click Submit. Step 3. After submitting the idea, you can download the acknowledgement letter from here. For this, click on the download button. Please give your experience a rating. Click download certificate to start downloading the certificate. The certificate will start downloading on your phone or desktop automatically.